Hello guys, welcome to Caveman Day 3. Um, so yeah, it's uh, really hot outside. Uh, like, like uh, something like 90 degrees. So, that is the summer. <laughs> or at least here in Alabama. But, so, I got to get some stuff done. I came here wearing a, or wearing a t-shirt and shorts, and I'm still burning up. So what we're going to do is take this here grass, and hopefully tie a knot around our very sketchy, very non-cool fireplace, because the grass ripped, and hopefully we can knot it back, so I'll, uh, I'll see you when that happens. All right, guys, we got it done. It's better than a box of scraps, although it is a little bit messy. So I guess what we're gonna do now is kind of liven up the area a little bit because the grass is all over the place. So uh, I'll see you when that's happening. Well, off camera, I dug this little hole, and hopefully, we can create some mud. So, let me go get some water. All right, y'all, we got totally not my kitchen sink water. We got some paper towels because I don't want my iPad to get all muddy. Yeah, I know I said only natural materials, but uh, I don't want my hands to get muddy. So, uh, I'll see you when that happens. All right, guys, I executed the plan. And it actually worked pretty well. I poured some water. Here's it now. Pretty disgusting. Hasn't dried yet, but I'm I'm pretty happy of what happened. But I see you guys later in the day, cause I feel like I'm about to be scorched in an oven hotter than 200 degrees. So uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you later in the day. Hey guys, it is later in the day and. Uh, it's scorching hot, and I don't want to go out there all sunburnt, so uh, enjoy the footage you have. Uh, I'll check on you tomorrow, see how the mud's doing, but I did successfully make mud, and it's a small amount, but it'll do, but uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.